This is an identity where we have to prove that the one side is the same as the other side. So you typically choose the more complicated side to start and so we're going to say left hand side. Okay, now we can just write it down again. What I would like you to identify is the following. Cos 2x, sin 2x. Those are double angle formulas or identities. We can use our formula sheet now. Now the big question that I always get from students is which ones do I choose? What's nice about sin 2x is it only has one. So we can change that one so long. So that's just going to give us 2 sin x cos x. Now for the cos one, I don't want you to just guess. There's actually a structured way to do this. We can see on the right hand side that we're trying to get to tan. Now we should know that tan is sin over cos. What this should show us is that we would like to have sin at the top. So the one we will choose is the one that gives us sin. See guys, it's quite easy. And then what we do is we always have to replace it in a bracket. So we say 1 minus, then in a bracket, that is very important, 1 minus 2 sin squared x, and then at the bottom we still have 2 sin x cos x. We then get rid of the brackets, and so that's going to give us 1 minus 1 plus 2 sin squared x over 2 sin x cos x. Now what you should see is that these ones would cancel and what we can now do is cancel out these twos, cancel out a sin and then you'll still have one sin left over and so what we're left with is sin x over cos x which is the same as tan x and therefore left hand side is the same as the right hand side.